Now let me bring in Eric Bollard. He's a senior fellow at Media Matters for America. Uh, Eric, uh, what do you think distinguishes Fox News <laughs> from the other media outlets? I thought I was going to say from the Republican Party. I was laughing because <laughs> it's, it's impossible. There's no daylight anymore. And now they, they, they don't apparently care who knows it. What distinguishes them from the other news outlets is, is they don't do news. I mean, it's that simple. Um, you know, years ago, five, six years, years ago, they were a conservative news outlet. They, they presented the, the news in a conservative, friendly way. Ever since an inauguration day with Obama, they have become the opposition party. They are picking the candidates. As you, as you pointed out, they essentially created the Tea Party movement. I mean, if there was any logic to this, it would be the Republican Party donating a million dollars to Fox News, not the other way around. Right. And Fox News also does the indirect donation by giving Sarah Palin a lot of money, Newt Gingrich a lot of yep. money, Mike Huckabee a lot of money, while they wait to run for president. So that's, uh, there's that angle to it, too. But let me throw the same questions at you. Yeah. What are the, what's the Democratic Party supposed to do? I mean, how do you fight back against this? Well, I mean, I think the, the, the White House sort of started getting it right last fall. As you, re, as you pointed out, they, de they declared Fox News is now a legitimate news organization. As, and as you noted, there was a, a sort of this freak out within the Beltway press. Let's, do, let's, try, let's have a do-over. Let's see who among the Beltway media elite after today specifically will stand up and say, yeah, you know, we, we think Fox is really doing great news. They're not doing news. They're doing propaganda. They're, they're, they're the Eric. opposition party. And now everyone really, this is yet another example of why everyone should understand that. Right, Eric, real quick, I mean, is that the bottom line here? Is it up to the rest of the media to say, hey, look, it's okay, you can be conservative media. Right. There's nothing wrong with that. Right. Just, we're not going to take your news at face value like you're any other news organization. We're going to say, okay, that's the conservative spin on this, but and then put it in its proper context. W yeah. Would that really help? Would that be the main answer? I think it would help. I think if they look at what Fox News does and see it's no different than the right-wing blogosphere, it's no different than what Bill Crystal is magazine does. It's, it's purely partisan right-wing media. It's purely GOP propaganda. And if people want to see that for what it is, that's fine. Let's just, let's just end the charade about it being a news organization. All right, Eric Bowler, thank you so much for joining us. Thanks. All right, All right coming up, up, I love that President Obama took it to Mitch McConnell and to the righties for obstructionism. I'm going to show you why the party of no is worthless. Yeah, I said that.